arm because you're good at what you do. Let's see what you got. This man in a golden arm right Putting that root in on 175. Huh? Putting that root in on 175. Are you? Yes. Oh, it's got some, uh, right, you can see that high low where it ain't broke down right there, but the rest of it's going in all right. It's going back around that way. Oh, okay, that one, yeah. Right. Oh, there it is. Back it up a little bit. Go up. All right. Let's see it. Oh, damn, show sure it. That's a cheap, too. I got clear a while ago. I can't see it now. There it is. You see that? You see that wall right on the top where it's um, it's got so much. Yeah. Like sucked back, but it's uh huh. It's so much high low, and you see it. It's got a like bench all the way around, easy. Oh, I can see it. Yeah. On more. That's where that piece is flared out, and they didn't count them well with that. Damn, bro. What's up? That's the man right there. <laughs> Alright. Huh? Yeah, yeah. For sure. I'm gonna jump on down and see what I can do. This yours or mine? Go ahead, I got one right here. Alright. What you got halfway? I'm almost uh plus. yeah, you're about halfway. Plus. Halfway plus. plus. Yeah. Almost? Plus. Yeah. No BS. I ain't playing one. <laughs> Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah, we got some uh, 309 over here. Carbon, stainless. And uh, I'm just flushing it out. I'm just flushing it out. I came back behind uh, day shift. We on night shift. And it's real in the field today. Welcome this vibe right here. Come get some of this vile action, baby. Come on. Yeah, come get some of this vile action. Yeah, these tight sponsors, no joke. Y'all know how I always show you. But uh, ain't nothing to it but to do it. Well, that's a good welder. You know, the roof looked a little rough, but at the end of the day, this is not x-ray. You had to fight with that gap. Going back to where I be talking about these students. But you know how it go. The welder gonna throw the fitter, the fitter gonna throw the welder. Here, there's nowhere up here. The devil is actually down here, as you can see. From here to there. So like I said, I almost got it flush. Just rolling with it. I'm using a uh, this 150 rig right here. A lot of people like to blast their heat up to like 175, 200 using this 150 rig. The thing about that is. careful whenever you cut your heat really high using this 150 rig because you can melt the block you know on the end of your sig rig you got a block and um, before you know it, it'll melt the copper wire that's inside of this rig and then you will have a disaster you can try to figure out um, can't get no connection why don't you have any 
any art. And what has what what's actually had happened is that you melted the wire inside the cigarette. Yeah, inside this inside this rubber right here, it's copper. You're running on 200 amps with a 150 rig. You won't do that for long. So get yourself a 250 rig. It's a little bit bigger. And the block at the end, let me see if you can see it. Yeah, you see that right there? Yeah, that little black block down there on the ground. It's way bigger. It's way thicker. It's gonna hold a lot more heat. And that's what really makes the difference in the inner guts of uh, the TIG rig. But yeah, we out here, night shift, making it happen. Getting that money, you know how we do. Same old, just a different job. you got to tell the young guys out there that's in the field trying to be like you don't give but it don't get you nowhere all right come on now you know yeah can you fit back there two hands baby two hands you need two hands to be able to weld Practice with your left and your right. I'm gonna take that tight side right there. You know I'm shy, baby, I'm shy, I'm too shy. Oh, it's, a real, it's a real welder right there. It is? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's just jumbled up right here. Oh yeah, they just crammed rod in there, that's what it was. So Chase, does it pay to be in shape, man, and fit in these tight spots? Oh yeah, you better work out. <laughs> I be trying to tell him. Well, that's the man right there. That man oh. holding the camera's it there. No. That's the real deal. Hey, guess what his stencil number is? AK-47, he shoot every time. <laughs> Come on now, shoot every time, huh? That's right. <laughs> Let me inspire. <laughs>